Hello everyone. Today I'm going to be showing you a technique that you can use to inspect 3D objects before you have them printed. 3D printing requires that you create closed, sealed objects, and oftentimes you can lock detail into those objects, but you'd still like to inspect it before it goes out the door. You can use this easy technique to make sure that everything's good to go. You can see I've created a simple object here. It is sort of like a coolant component. Hot air or water can come in through the top, and then it's cooled using coolant that flows through these pipes. It then flows out the bottom. Within this object, I have the 3D pipes, but unfortunately, I just can't really see them in an easy way. So what I can do is using the editable poly that I plan to send to the printer, I can go through the top, select the polygons somewhere in the object. Let's say everything in this quadrant, and I can delete it. Then I can inspect inside relatively easily. This may seem like a simple technique, but checking your models before they go out the door is a really good idea. An alternative technique, if you have relatively simple objects, can be to create sort of a 3D spotlight. Let's try this out now. So I have here a simple tower, and I've cut some holes through it, and one hole through the top. What I can do is create a sphere and place it intersecting the object. Then, using the target object as a pro-boolean, I can select my sphere as a subtraction object. Now, selecting it as an operand, I can move it around. It's kind of like a 3D spotlight. It lets you see inside of complicated objects. That said, remember that you don't want to do this to anything that's too high poly because it's really going to tax your 3D card, and it could even crash your instance of 3D Studio Max. So make sure you save before you do this.